Hi, I'm Heather. I paint a real favorite arts, and today is my December 2017 Darn Good Yarn unboxing. Um, if you have, if you um haven't watched one of these unboxing videos for me, and you don't know what Darn Good Yarn is, I am going to tell you what that is right now. It is a monthly yarn subscription that you get every month. You pay for it on the first, and then you get it at the end of the month. Um, it is ten dollars plus shipping so it's ten dollars plus four dollars shipping for me because I'm in the US so it's fourteen dollars a month for me and um, so far it's worked out really really well um, and everything um, and the company Darn Good Yarn is a really really good company they are a company that is from New York but they help um, ladies in India and Nepal um, get jobs pretty much with fair wages which is really really cool and really awesome considering those countries don't have the greatest jobs for ladies so it's really cool to know that they help um, support the ladies out there with a really nice job and everything um, they also have some other information about all of that all on their website that is linked down below as well as um, how much um, they have some other yarn not yarn subscriptions but they are like um, they have I think a bead subscription that's every month they get a new kind of beads or something and they have one for fabric and all of that information is down in their subscription area and also how to get a darn good yarn box is all linked down below and everything and um if you buy anything off their website using that link as well as if you buy darn good yarn box you're actually helping me out by using that link because i'm also affiliated with them and uh, it doesn't cost you any money but I do make a small percentage off of each sale that um, someone each time somebody uses one of those links so I think that would be really cool because it's a win-win you get a nice beautiful yarn and I get a few dollars in my pocket which is awesome so it's a win-win <laughs> so that way I can continue making awesome videos for all of you and um, getting these yarn boxes and everything um, so yeah um, and everything um, I'm, so, I'm excited to open this up. Um, unfortunately, as much as I like Darn Good Yarn and I like all the unboxings that I've done with them, um, this is going to be the last one for a couple months. I might start them up in like the spring again, but for now I'm just going to move on to some other yarn unboxings for all of you for some newer and other other yarn boxes since I'm always looking at um, yarn boxes to try. So I thought that it would be um, a good time for next year to try out a couple of new on um, new yarn subscriptions or like some other kinds of um, maybe even yarn kits or something but you'll see some really cool unboxings next year and I decided to replace darn good yarn with that as well as yarn crush for a couple of months and then I probably will go back to um, yarn crush and darn good yarn but for now that's what's going on um, so yeah I'm going to open this up and I'm excited. I hope that I hope this looks as pretty as I've seen some unboxings of this yarn and, and for this month because I'm doing this kind of at the end of this month because I've been so busy and everything so that I've had this for a couple days. But I just thought, oh, I want to open up together with my YouTube channel. So I was saving it for all of you to open with all of you. So um, and everything. But at the same time, I saw some unboxings of this and wow, the yarn looks so pretty. I hope my yarn looks just as pretty. So yeah, um, so pretty much with every subscription you get a yarn pattern as well as a cool gift and you get some skeins of yarn. I forgot to put that in the beginning, sorry about that. And it just does not want to open by hand even though they have little rippy things, but it doesn't want to open. So I'm making sure there's no yarn in there that I'm cutting and I'm going to use the scissors. Because that would be really sad if I put my yarn instead. So, and I didn't, so it's all good. Woo. So yay! Oh, so this is um, just some info and stuff they send you, and then they send you the pattern and the, the yarn. Oh wow, this yarn's so pretty! Oh my gosh, it's even more prettier than what I saw the yarn going around. Um, another unboxing. I'm super excited. And it's actually, oh my gosh, it's so soft. I'm 
So I'm going to tell you something before about it and tell you and then show you what my goodie is, which is super cute, and the yarn and what I, what they suggest to make with it. This is, um, oh, so this is about the gift first and then I will show the yarn, sorry. Just happened to be the thing in my hand. Um, so this is a really cool like button company, I guess, and um, it's called um, Incomparable Buttons and they are all handmade and hand painted in South Africa. It's a family business and it was started around a kitchen table by Jen Pasquale over 30 years ago. Many of our wonderful ladies have been with us for more than 25 years. Oh wow, that's amazing. Um, to have a company that people want to stay with people that long, that means they're special and that's so cool. <laughs> um, when, they first, when they first joined us, most of our team had never had a paintbrush before. Now they are masters of their skills and justify the bully proud of their work. Oh, that's so cool. Another inspiring lady company. Oh, I love that about Darn Good Yarn. They inspire me as a woman to do cool stuff. <laughs> but anyways, it says each bite is a unique work of art. Um, it is fully washable and we recommend turning the garments inside out before washing if um, you have a button of theirs, so that way their buttons stay nice and pretty. And it says, thank you for um, helping us to create employment for women in South Africa. Yay! And it says, um, Button Mad on Facebook is, a, is one of their Facebook things. And it says their little website, which is buttonmade.com. So cool. I'll put their little link down below in case you want a cute little button. Oh my gosh, this button is so adorable. I think I'll be checking them out as getting some other cute ones and it is a cute little reindeer I love reindeers oh my gosh that's why I made two in my Christmas video that is super cute I love it they're so it's cute oh, the camera focus there you go oh my gosh the camera doesn't even do it justice it's just too cute for words oh my gosh I love it and it has to be a cool animal that I love I love all animals but reindeer is definitely one of them <laughs> Anyways, check out the beautiful yarn, and then I'll be reading about it to you. Oh my gosh, did it just give me one skein of it? They gave me two for once. That's such a cool Christmas present, like, from them, that they're, that they're giving everybody two. And, wow, this looks so gorgeous. It looks even more prettier than some, some of the yarn that I saw going on on boxings. Like, some of them I saw, they looked much darker. This one looks more pink, and pink is my color. I am super excited. It is multicolored and it's so soft and oh my gosh, it's not printing on my skin. I thought it was going to print on my skin. <laughs> oh wow, that's awesome because last time I said a little more pinky from them, it wanted to print the yarn dye all over me so <laughs> I was making sure it wasn't going to be something you had to wash right away. So. Um, I still suggest washing their yarn because um, sometimes the frilly stuff and everything can just go everywhere, but just hand wash it before it, before um, using it always, but you could just use it right as is too. It is so shiny and pretty. I just have to show it off again. <laughs> anyway, so let's read about what it is. It says, um, Garn, Darn Good Yarn of the Month, Happy Holidays from the Garn, Darn, not Garn, Darn Good Yarn family. Um, it says we wanted to spread some holiday cheer, so this month we added an extra skein of our Kaleidoscope Banana Fiber Yarn. Oh, I was interested in the Banana Fiber Yarn. It just wasn't, um, the color I wanted was like sold out one time when I was on there. It's not anymore, but uh, probably because she restocks really fast. And then, um, the other colors just weren't really what I was looking for at the time, so I wasn't sure how it looked. But now that I know it's so pretty, it makes me want it, but I did not know that they had a multicolored one, or maybe if they did, I was think it looked different on the computer. So I really like the multicolored of this. It's so gorgeous. Ah. And it says, now you can make a scarf for you and your friend or give one to someone in need. So that's the yarn pattern that they suggest to do with it. Um, I'm probably not going to do a scarf with it. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it. Maybe a nice little head or a hairband. I like hairbands more than hats, so I think that might be what it will be. Um, and it says, uh, let's know some cool facts about banana fibers. Uh, banana fiber yarn, fun facts. Did you know it's a vegan yarn? Each skein is 100 grams and the gauges are 3 to 3.5 stitches to the inch. 
dry cleaner hand wash and lay them flat to dry. Although this doesn't come with a little tag on it, I like that they put the little facts on these papers. Like if you don't look at the papers, then obviously you're not going to know what it is, but it explains more what it is. But I still think that it would be best if it did have a little tag on it because when I put it up in like where my other, all my yarns are, it's not going to have this piece of paper anymore. That's one thing I gotta say about these yarn clips. I wish she put little tags on them. She doesn't always put tags on them. Like if you order one through her website, um, that is not a yarn subscription. She will put a tag on it and I really like that because then you always know what it is. <laughs> It says the yarn is handcrafted in the Fair Trades Women's Co-ops in Raul, uh, Raul uh, Nepal and India. There would be inconsistencies every now and then, like thick and thin spots or knots, but that is what gives the fiber its charm and proves that it was made by a human hand, not a machine. Oh, I like the honesty of it, so that way I kind of know what's expected because sometimes I get some of their yarn and if I don't read about it, a little bit about what she did if I just took it and looked at it I would be like what is going on but when she explains why it is how it is I like that simple explanation and that um, it's pretty honest and that's pretty cool and really cool actually because then I know kind of what to expect with it I mean this is recycled so it's not gonna be perfect machine yarn and if you're not into recycled yarn um, darn good yarn most of theirs actually all their stuff's recycled so that's why it's not like super super perfect like you get from like um from michael's you know <laughs> or some or like other machine machine kind of yarn so um that's the reason it isn't it's affordable that's another thing i like about it and um i like the fact i like the recycled kind of like funky look and it gets me out of my normal um uh, kind of machine machine spun or like mill spun or even hand spun yarn it gets me out of like that normalness to some funkiness that's what i love about this it gets me to try something that i never thought i would try um so that's why i'm kind of sad to not get the unboxings anymore but i'm happy to move on to other things so <laughs> it says um but i will do unboxing still i'm saying just not with darn good yarn so but i do plan on um they definitely will come back around <laughs> because I can't get over how gorgeous this is. So um, it says, we know you want to see the pattern and colors. So, so this month we are offering the yarn of the month pattern as a download. Oh, that's neat. So you can download it on your computer. And then it says um, to a way to win one of their gift cards and everything. And um, if you get one of these, you, you will know how to win one of their little gift cards, which is super cool. I like that they give back and they show you cool ways to win that. So, um, oh yeah, so instead of the pattern being printed out, she was saying that it's going, it's like an online um, download thing and it's a, good, it's a scarf. I just wanted to make sure there's no like printed one with it, but yeah. Um, so yeah, this is pretty much the yarn of the, actually not pretty much, this is the yarn of the month for December 2017 of Darn Good Yarn in a nice happy um, nice happy end of the year for having them with me uh, and having them and everything I've had them for like about six months or so and this is the sixth um, yarn subscription from them so it would be cool to see when I start them back up in a couple months um, what else is going on with them and what other fun stuff she has available at Darn Good Yarn and everything um, so yeah, um, I still will be buying yarn from them, and I still will be uh, showing off pretty yarn from them as uh, my channel um, as I get yarn from them. Um, another good thing I love is this is the I mean, the yarn that's for sale. She sends like a lot of times they're like buy one get ones or like buy one half off or like super good prices on whatever yarn is for the um, is the yarn yarn unboxing of the month and also other yarns of hers. So. I highly suggest everybody, I know drug mail, I know newsletters, you get a thousand of them, but if you do sign up to them, sign up to their newsletters, you will get awesome coupons and everything. Like I have my, their coupons all over on my other email account and not on this Paint the World one. And 
um, because of, because of that, I've been not seeing as many little emails or free patterns she's been doing a lot of lately. So whenever I hop over to that that um, email, I just get like a bunch of them from her. But at the same time, a lot of them are like free patterns and stuff. So I get super excited because I'm like, yeah, it gets a free downloaded pattern that looks super cute and adorable and can't wait to use it. And that's about it that I have for this unboxing. And I will talk to you again either on Mondays and our PJs, or Friday late nights podcast, or the next unboxing that you watch from me, um, or whatever video that you decide to watch of mine. And as always, please click like if you like this video down below, as well as if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe by hitting the subscribe button up top. And um, that way you can um, always find me, and that way I'm not buried under a thousand other um, people's uh, um, YouTube videos that they make and everything um and that way you know when the newest and latest video is out for me by also clicking the bell so that way it goes ding ding and you get a nice little notification that is from uh, that will be from my youtube channel and that way you know when my latest videos are um as well as you can email me always it is at paintofrealfiberarts at gmail.com please um as always um follow or join me on my or follow me or just check out my blog is at https dot dot slash slash w uh sorry https dot dot slash slash painterbrill fiber arts um dot com and as always um if you would like to buy any of my handmade items or anything that I um crochet up or knit up or whatever um that will be at my on uh, my Etsy shop and that is at https dot dot slash slash www.etsy.com slash shop slash paint of real fiber arts I mean paint of real fiber art not arts or um, you can just click go to um, https dot dot slash slash www.etsy.com and type in paint of real fiber art and click the little um, it, click the little thing that says paint of real fiber art and voila my shop will pop up and that's where you can buy any of my handmade items that I crochet or knit or any of my latest things that are on there and that helps support me and my family as well as it helps you get a nice little cute little um, crocheted or knitted object for me um, and as always please join uh, join or like or follow or whatever on um, all my social media says Instagram, blog Lovin, um, Twitter and Facebook and all those are linked down below as well as my Etsy shop is linked down below as well as my blog is all linked down below everything that I say is always linked down below and anything that I've forgotten is all linked down below and have a great rest of the day night afternoon no matter where you're from and I will talk to you next time thank you so much bye bye